Good morning and welcome to FA Cup semi-final day two. It's Aston Villa against Chelsea at the Banks Stadium up in Birmingham. And uh, we're going, we're going soon. I'm just making the kids pack lunch and then we're going to go on the road. But before we go, I thought I should show you my new artwork in the kitchen. Mo Ali, Chloe Kelly. Oh. Hide the words. Isn't that fab? Like, aren't we just really impressed with that and how different it is? Never mind the black marks on the wall. Oh, right there. Because that's the back of the chairs banging against them. I need to get that changed. Are you coming to the football? Who are you supporting today? Villa. Villa. Show them in your t shirt. Wow. What's your name? Anne Brooks. Anne Brooks. And you're the best boy I've ever met. And where's Katie? Where's Katie? She yeah. might see us at the football today as well. <gasps> wow. So let's just, Annie's got a glass dish. That's my parenting, everyone. One other thing to point out is that Rusha wasn't happy about the whole Chloe Kelly scenario, so she just decided to smash it. Iconic moment though, isn't it? But yeah, I said if she does something iconic, she can go on this wall over here. Yeah, but we're doing a quick vlog. Show everyone your friends. Ah, oh, Tiger. Who, what team are you going to go support today? Which is called? No, Arsenal. Villa. Up the villa. So we've just stopped for a quick. <laughs> and on that farm he had a nugget no no um so we're heading up to the game now and i've had a look around at team news and as we can see um millie bright still out for for chelsea and kadisha buchanan also out for chelsea which i'm like okay okay if i'm going to not be neutral today I'm supporting Villa today. Chelsea are on a very, very good side, and we've got to look at what happened two weeks ago in the league. Chelsea battered them. Chelsea, they absolutely battered them. Chelsea, Chelsea. Chelsea, Chelsea. <laughs> you can't see that. <laughs> so. Chelsea, Chelsea, Chelsea. Rusha's gonna have you. She's gonna eat your bum. Thank you. So um, oh God. Should, be, should be fun in the Bella stands today. Good job. Whoa! Ouch! Ouch! Yeah! Man down. Penalty. Bumped into the one and only Rihanna oh, no. Barrera. <laughs> She's got a flag, we've got a flag, we've got a flag. Um, how do you see this one going today? And who do you support? I support Liverpool. Right, right. but I never get to Liverpool because that's so far away. And Prenton Park's just really bad. Like, <laughs> But yeah, today, it pains me to say it because I actually do have such a soft up villa. But I'm going to say, I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to speak bad things into the universe. But do you know what? I mean, Chelsea, we know what their squad's like, but they are down to the best. Well, you should be Cannon and Millie Bright. I'm 99% sure I just saw Penilla Harder. I might be going crazy oh, there because I didn't see the squad list, but I'm almost certain I just saw Penilla Harder there. Oh, she can't come back for one cameo and make it to that final, I'm not can she? She can't she do can't it. that to Villa. Why would you do that do to it. Villa, Penilla? Okay, have a good game. I will, I will speak to you hopefully at halftime yeah. or full time. We're going to go outside now, Brooksy. Okay. Chelsea, Chelsea, Chelsea. 
Yeah. yeah. Okay, guys, let's head outside. It's always good when there's lots of friendly faces nearby to babysit for you. Thanks, Charlie. Thanks, Rihanna. Have a good night. Okay, so it's half time, half time at the Bank Stadium. Pure cold. Um, I have to say, I have a feeling for Villa. There's been a couple of chances from both sides. I think Chelsea were de definitely dominant in the first kind of 15 minutes. Villa have been okay since. Hey, it's Villa! <laughs> uh, Villa have been very good since. So we wait and see what happens. There was a moment just before half time and I thought, uh oh, it could happen for Aston Villa. But so far, it remains nil nil at half time in the FA Cup semi final. I will keep you posted. We've got a minute to go. The amount of chances created, and Villa's been brilliant. Jump on the trains. Live recently with the chicks. Uh, why did Barclays WSL just mention me in their story? Guys. Good session. <laughs> Did you score? She got a couple. He Good actually goals. got one at the end. Go on in. Get in. Yeah. So we're on the road. Back home. Kids had a good day to be fair. Um so disappointed for Villa because it definitely in that last ten minutes they had so many chances. They were creating a lot of chances. Just couldn't put them away. And Credit to Chelsea, Sam Care, Sam Care things. They do what they do, and that's the that is what the big experienced teams will do to the likes of Villa in those situations. Unless they're going to really take those chances, then Chelsea will make sure they get the win. So it's disappointing for Aston Villa. I saw Carl Ward at the end there, heartbroken. Those are words. Players de deflated as well. They've had such a good run in this competition. And actually over here, Dana Hayes giving an interview saying like the quality of teams now are just starting to bridge the gap and it's not as easy as thinking that we're Chelsea Arsenal final. Yes, Chelsea are still there, but Villa weren't far off. Makes it more exciting as well for next season, I think, this competition. Um, and my trip 
to Wembley won't be supporting Villa this time round. Till next time, I will see you soon.